Yo, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video on Baboa. So you guys can see Sorcery did end up coming back. So I'm going to be giving my own opinions on the re-release of Sorcery. If you guys don't remember what Sorcery was, I did cover it I think like two, three months ago. But basically it was that game, JJK game, the potion style game that ended up resulting inside of an exit scam. Some 14 year old was owner, took everyone's money, boom, yada yada. And apparently the game is back under a new owner. And I won't lie, not much has changed at all like as far as the game that i played two three four months ago and the game that i'm playing right now um i'm not gonna lie i'm not noticing a singular difference i won't hold you the game is the exact same and they've apparently been in development for two months ever since you know they bought the game and i'm not noticing a single difference apparently they added two new curse techniques and they added a cooling games game mode which i believe is basically just the battle royale map but without the battle royale aspects like i don't know bro um for two months they haven't added much i won't lie the game is basically still the exact same uh which is fine you know it was an okay game it wasn't really anything crazy it was just jjk deep and you know a very basic game um but the game did come back the game does have 30k players right now which is kind of insane um, they had like 35k earlier a lot of people are playing it so i'll be giving my own thoughts on the re-release and basically just the game in general if you guys do end up enjoying it like and subscribe uh but yeah let's just get right into it all right so the very first thing that i want to say is the way that they're going to actually release this game has to be one of the most dumb things i think i've ever heard because the game is public right now right people are playing it the game has 30k active players they're gonna take that all away and what they're gonna do instead is make the game 800 robux i think a week from now i think a week from now they said a week from now the game is going to be 800 robux instead of free and i'm not gonna hold you when i say this i don't think anyone's gonna buy it i believe deep Ocean is half off right now for like 200 robux so for the same price you can buy you a friend and two other friends deep Ocean, and have a whole squad for deep Ocean. or you can play sorcery which is just deep ocean with way less content and based off jjk like if i'm being honest i don't think many people are gonna buy this game because the game isn't very fun <laughs> like the game is not fun at all in my own opinion i've played this game a decent amount of, like i've played it a decent amount i won't lie and yeah the game's just not good it's it's just genuinely not good um it's okay it basically has the same amount of content as the average naruto copy with basically the same combat system honestly it just feels like a naruto copy but jjk like it's honestly not great at all uh basically to level up you do missions you hit special grade you get your domain expansion you do whatever and then you go into open world and fight people over and over and over again and then you get bored and you quit the game like that's that's literally what you do and oh you can do cooling games once per life in this game and apparently you just get teamed on and die yep that's pretty much what the whole game is um not only that the combat system i mean it, the, the, the combat system's okay right there's nothing to really complain about with the combat system but for some reason to use any abilities to flash tap to do anything you have to hold e the whole time you guys see this purple aura that's coming off of me yeah you have to hold e for that to appear and that is the only way to flash up the only way to use abilities the only way to really do anything is to have that curse meter at the bottom all the way up all the time which has to be the most dodgiest system I think I've ever played with. Um, the game, in all honesty, if I had to rate it, I'd give it about a 7. It's not great in any way, shape, or form at all. Um, it's okay, I guess. If you are really desperate for a game, that's why this game has 30 day players, since people are really desperate for a game. Like, if you really want to pay 800 Robux for it, go ahead. Um, but I'm not gonna delays the game like every other youtuber because vert and revolver are just paid off to delays any game that they ever touch um, I won't lie, especially Vert. vert. I know he's didn't paid a heavy from this game, but I can't blame him Hey, if they offered me payment, I probably delays this shit, too. I won't lie um, But the game it's not I I don't even know bro. It's it's a very weird game. Uh, the combat's okay. Like it's no okay game It's all right. It's just not good um apparently you have to do an obby which i don't know why games haven't learned from type so just don't put fucking obbies inside your game nobody likes them uh but yeah let's go level up a bit so you guys can see what you do in this game because this is literally what you do from an innate sorcerer or an innate curse 
all the way up to special grade, this is what you do. You go in here, you do missions. It says clear curses, okay? So let's go kill, like, I think it's like three curses. The maps look decent. Everything about this game is all right. Like, I'm not saying that it's a bad game, uh, but just, it, it's, it's a bad game. Like, <laughs> It's not the worst game I've ever played, but it's definitely not the best. I'll tell you that much. Uh, but yeah, this is basically what you do to level up the whole time. And then once when you do this, your option is go play coin games and pray that you win. Or go fight people and quit the game, pretty much. There's there's no actual content inside this game at all. Uh, people are complaining about type soul have, having no content. This game is a whole nother level of no content. Nothing to do. Uh, because Type Soul, like, they had Clan Wars, they had some stuff. And I'm not trying to say Type Soul is a good game, because it's not a good game. But compared to this game, this game makes Type Soul look phenomenal, I'm not gonna lie. Because this game is just actually awful. Like, there's nothing to do. You level up, you get, like, maybe your domain expansion, if you truly want to grind the game that much, then you get your domain expansion, and then you quit the game. Like, that's literally what you do. Um, it's not good at all in my own opinion you guys once again you can have your own thoughts inside the comments and it's not because i'm bad at pvp like or anything um i see a lot of people in the comments of like i think it was misery's video that i was watching and they were all like oh well you just have a skill issue if you don't like this game you just can't parry no it's just a dog shit game like i would much rather play deep ocean um i don't know why people try to delay the game just because it's jjk like if you actually look at the game it's not fucking good at all you don't have to glaze the game just as it's JJK and it's the first decent JJK game that we have. Um, I would much rather pay $40 for Jujutsu Infinite and I fucking hate that game. Like, if I'm being 100% honest, this game is not good. And once when they change the game to 800 Robux, holy shit, yeah, this game is going to have absolutely zero players. And why do I get exterminate curses in this big ass map and it took me this long just to find one curse? I don't even know if this is a curse. Okay. It is. But, like, goddamn, dude. Took that long to find one fucking NPC. Um, but, yeah, this is what you do. So, you go to a curse, and you literally just fucking hit him. And then he falls into the abyss, and you're like, this name's dog shit, bro. <laughs> you can't make this up, bro. You cannot make up this fucking game, dude. Like, this shit is actually unreal. That wouldn't have even counted for a kill, by the way. That curse fell off. It didn't count for a kill. So I would have been stuck in there until the timer was over anyways. But let's just, like, go do another one so I can actually do, like, show you guys what the game is. It took me literally three minutes to find one NPC, then he fell off the map. And then, like, are we dead ass, bro? But yeah, the game, it's... I mean, it's alright. Okay, rescue. This, like, I believe there's only two mission types. There's rescue, and then there's exterminate. And rescue is way worse in my opinion because you literally are stuck running around the map looking for an npc that's dead on the floor you have to pick them up and then take them to the rescue point and then yeah that's that's what you do the whole time you literally just run around the map like the only two mission types in this game are both boring as fuck um there's no pvp missions there's no nothing like that so it's just like boring in every single possible way um i don't know i i'd honestly be surprised if the game doesn't like go down for like a month so they add more content because i'm telling you the only thing that they added since the scammer took everyone's money they added cooling games and they added like two curse techniques and that's all that they added in that time frame which is absolutely insane uh once when you load it into the game it says this game's only been in development for two months that's just a blatant fucking lie this game's been in development for like a year already because the scammer made the whole game and then sold it so you can't really say that it's only been in development for two months when everyone knows that that shit's not true like at all um yeah i don't know i don't even know why they would say that when people were playing the game two months ago like that shit makes no sense to me where the fuck like dude i ran across the whole map and i haven't found a single person to rescue like are we that ass like <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, bro. Maybe the, maybe my own opinion is, like, tainted because I'm banned and, like, I don't really see the Discord or anything, like, their announcements or what they plan to do or anything like that. Um, but the game is just not good, and I keep on seeing everybody glaze it, and it's just not a good game in any way, shape, or form, really. Um, yeah, I don't know. I, I honestly have no idea why people are playing this. Um, 
Can't even find the fucking person to rest you. Like, that shit's ass. Um, yeah, I, I, I don't know. You guys can feel free to leave your own thoughts. Like, if you like the game, give me your thoughts why you like the game, I guess. I mean, in all honesty, the only reason why I think this game has players is because Roblox is just that dry right now. And there's literally nothing to play. Uh, which is obviously going to be the case because there is nothing to fucking play. So, like, it's pretty obvious that people are going to want to play something. Um, because Roblox has been that ass recently. Like, there's literally fucking nothing to play. So, it's not surprising that this game does have players, uh, because there's nothing to play. But at the same time, like, I'll be surprised if this game lasts a week once when it's paid access. I won't, like, eh. I mean, it's okay, I guess. Um, yeah, you guys can leave your own thoughts inside the comments. I don't know how to do this fucking mission, so I'm just gonna leave. Uh, but yeah, let me show you guys the opening cutscene, because I'm not gonna hold you. The best part about this whole game is the opening cutscene. Like, when I saw the opening cutscene, I was like, oh shit, did they actually, like, decide to develop the game and actually change it? No, the actual core game has not changed at all. The only thing that has improved is the start. And they say little to no hand-holding. They were completely honest when they said that. And solo developer, that shit's tapped. They have a whole dev team. I don't know why they're saying solo developer. But this opening cutscene, I won't lie, is the best part about the whole game. Like, when I saw this, I was like, oh shit, wait, this game might actually be good. And then I loaded in, and it was the same exact game with no changes, no nothing. So you guys can feel free to give your own thoughts inside the comments. That's just my thoughts on the game. I'm not going to keep playing this game unless if this game does... Um, unless if this video goes crazy and you guys actually want a progression video. Um, but yeah, the game is just simply not good at all in my own opinion. You guys can leave your own opinions inside the comments down below. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys inside the next one. Peace.